What do transactional funders pay for? Transactional funders will take care of all expenses connected with the A to B closing for the investor buyer. The funding fees are then deducted from the investor's profit on the B to C closing. This allows the investor to not need any of his own money to close the A to B transaction. In the past, many investors would wholesale flip properties by doing a double closing by using their end buyer's funds to finance the A to B closing. However, with the tightening of regulations by title companies, because of title insurance issues, financing industry policies, and regulations, this end buyer financing has been dramatically reduced. Nowadays, real estate transactions are often funded before they can be resold. This is the way the procedure works when using transactional funding. The buyer investor or flipper called Party B writes an agreement to buy a property from the seller A. The buyer B signs this agreement with end buyer C to buy the property on the same day that B buys it from A. B looks for transactional funding to support the deal because he needs to purchase the property from A and resell it immediately to C. Transactional funding has huge benefits. The benefits of transactional funding are as follow. Credit score, salary of the borrower, and down payment are not required. Secondly, the funding is normally 100% of the net purchase amount. A transactional funding proof of funds letter is traditionally given by the transactional funding lender for the buyer to prove his credibility with the seller or the listing agent. Transactional funding has helped thousands of investors do deals until they have their own money, and the documentation is easy to complete. 